In this video, I'm going to show you on how you can remove background noise from the audio in your video project in Filmora. So I think if you have a recording that you, you might do in the outdoor environment where there are a lot of people talking and it makes your voice becoming inaudible, then there is actually a way in Filmora to at least reduce the amount of background noise so your voice is going to be more, more clear and audible. So I have this example that I made and this is actually my recording and i put some background music sorry not background music background people talking like i was in a public area and this is the result this is me talking with a lot of people talking in the background yeah this is actually kind of an extreme example because i think in the reality if you're recording using a proper microphone and even though there could be background noise it's usually not going to be very audible like this one this is let's say this is an extreme example so i will try to use filmora settings and see uh, how much clarity i can get from this audio file but first let's separate the audio from the video as you can see this is actually a video recording screen recording to be precise i'm going to right click and click detach audio so this is going to detach the audio from the video and you can actually put this somewhere else or you, could, you can just remove it i'm going to remove it because i don't really need that at the moment so we only have this audio file which is basically the same file this is me talking with a lot of people talking in the background all right now i'm going to open the audio panel i'm using filmora 14 so it's going to be located right here but if you don't see this menu you can click the edit setting right here the edit icon uh if you are using the plastic interface then you might have to click the edit icon right here and then you can play around with audio but if you're using the new layout on filmora 14 then you can uh, basically access that without opening the panel sorry opening the audio panel via this icon now on the audio section there are a bunch of settings and honestly disclaimer i'm not an audio expert but there are a few settings that uh, I could try. I usually use to at least make my audio more clear. Now, the first option is, of course, uh, we want to remove the no the noise. So you can click on this option, and you want to play around with this. But usually, this is actually not very good. So I usually never set it above twenty percent. And okay, let's try twenty percent and see the result. This is me talking with a lot of talking in the background. It was a bit better but if you actually go to let's say 100 it's actually not recommended because it also makes your actual audio to become inaudible this is me talking, talking in the yeah this is not something that you want to set uh, above 20 percent that's at least in my opinion but of course your audio file could be a little bit different so it's maybe okay to set it to you know 30 or 40 percent depending on the audio that you have on your project but for me, I think 20% should be enough. Now, another thing that you can do is you can use the new AI voice enhancer. This is very interesting. Uh, it offers you an option to make the voice more clear and also it will beautify your audio. It's very interesting. And I think there is good, they are using some sort of algorithm or maybe AI in the background. And we can set the level between zero to 100%. So it's very easy to understand and there's also voice beautification you have to play around with these options and you have to play the audio and see which setting is the best for your audio file this is me talking with a lot of people talking in the background right so let's increase that again maybe to around 60 let's try it again and hopefully this time around it's going to be better this is me talking with a lot of people talking in the background Okay, and I'm going to increase the voice beautification to 50%. This is me talking with a lot of people talking in the background. Okay, so that's uh, one option. You can also enable wind removal. This is uh, especially if you're recording in a windy situation. But in this case, it's actually doing very little. So this is me same. talking with a lot of people talking in the background. Or maybe not. I should not be enabling that. I think it was better without wind removal. This is me talking with Yeah, so I guess that's that's the only settings that I usually use. You can of course play around with the reverb, hum removal, his removal, but I usually rarely use this because uh, what would happen is that it's actually going to make the audio less audible. 
this is me talking with other people talking in the background yeah usually i almost never touch any of this so usually just go with the the noise AI and AI voice and sensor and you can also play around with the equalizer sometimes it's helpful so let's try rock and roll and let's see this is me talking with other people talking in the background well it's kind of debatable which setting is the be is better uh if you have headphones that i highly recommend to wear it but if you don't then that's okay i'm not using headphones this is me talking with other people talking in the background okay it's kind of difficult so i guess i'm going to go with classic usually classic is going to work with you know a lot of scenario this is me talking with other people talking in the background or maybe not okay so i guess using equalizer is not fit for this particular audio so basically it was the, the noise setting the ai voice enhancer and sometimes equalizer as well you can also by the way increase the volume uh, if you want you can also enable auto normalization but then again this is not going this will affect not only the actual voice but also the background noise so you have to be mindful when using this feature but now we have this audio let's try comparing it with the original version i'm going to just copy and i will basically just remove all, all the settings for this particular track so let's set it to zero I'll reset everything and let's change the color to red so this is before this is after this is me talking with other people talking in the background this is me talking with other people talking in the background definitely better so this is uh, this is before this is me talking with other people talking in the background this is me talking with other people talking in the background certainly this is me talking certainly not perfect but i can attest that this is definitely better uh, than the previous than the original audio so again this was actually an uh, extreme example so that's why the audio why not very good but I, this method is going to be working for a lot of cases or a lot of audio that you are working in your film or a project so that's basically how you can remove the background noise from the audio in your Filmora video project. I hope this tutorial is helpful and I'll see you on the next video.